I'll find a way of taking care of that Steve Zodiac. Hello. Jack, you're sure you ran a real thorough check on that supply freighter? I Commander Zero. I was the last person to leave the ship and all checks red green. Roger, Jack. Just wanted to make sure. Okay, Lieutenant 90. You can start countdown as soon as you're ready. Blast off minus 10 seconds. Space City to Fireball XL5. Countdown has started, Steve. Roger, Commander Zero. We're ready to lift off as soon as the supply ship is airborne. Clear for liftoff. Roger, Commander. Well, so far, so good. I wonder where our crooked salvage boys are waiting. Somewhere along the route, I guess. Okay, Joe. We're on free float. Now to fix Steve Zodiac. Yeah. Uh, but are you sure he'll be fooled by that tape recorder? Emergency red. Emergency red. We are on fire. Request aid at once. Zodiac Position. just can't ignore a call for help like that. He'll alter course and head for the position the recorder gives out. And then he's off our backs. Now all we have to do is push it out into space where it will start transmitting just for Colonel Zodiac. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Emergency red. We are on fire. We are on fire. Request emergency rescue. We are ejecting into space now. Say, Matt, I'm getting a signal. Have you traced it? Uh, yes, Steve. I've got it. Uh, it seems to be in our sector. Uh, position, uh... 24 one. Yeah, and we're the nearest ship. We'll have to check it out. Fireball XL5 to Space City. Did you get that distress signal? I'm going to have to alter course and leave the supply freighter, Commander Zero. Okay, Steve. Guess we've no choice. I might have known something like this would happen. I don't understand it, Steve. This is the position that was given. But there's no sign of a ship. Well, hold on, Matt. I can see an object ahead. Emergency red. Emergency red. Check on it, will you? I've got it, Steve. See? That's mighty odd. It's a tape recorder. I might have known. A hoax. A dirty trick. And I don't need three guesses to tell me who planted that thing there. I guess the Briggs boys have done it again. Now, this calls for a council of war. I feel such a tootie falling for a thing like that. A phony distress call. Why, well, that's one of the corniest tricks in the business. Oh, don't blame yourself too much, Steve. You want to know. It could have been for real. That's right, Steve. We're dealing with a mighty smart bunch of characters. But don't worry. We'll catch up with them. Yeah, you can say that again, Matt. If it's the last thing I do, I'll nail those characters. And I think I know how to do it. So you think you know how to do it, eh, Steve? Well, let's hear it. It's pretty simple, Commander. First of all, I want you to send up another robot freighter and have Jock do his double check again. Ugh, oh, this is getting monotonous. 
The freighter checks all read green again. I can't see how this sabotage is being worked. Ah, it's a real puzzle to me.